In 2011, before Colorado, Oregon, and Washington legalized marijuana, there were nearly 750,000 arrests out of the 1.5 million drug arrests made nationwide. That is an arrest for every 42 seconds for marijuana and 21 seconds for other drug-related crimes. In 1982, the war on drugs, or the Get Tough on Crime era, has led to law enforcement and sentencing changes that would incarcerate 41,000 in 1982, and by 2014, nearly 500,000 would be incarcerated. In the last 40 years, we have seen 2.2 million in prison or jails. That is a 500% increase since 1976. Nearly 600 people will end up in prison or jails for every 100,000 inhabitants. In a change to society, marijuana is legal and the courts will order rehabilitation and counseling for low-level offenders. After the legalization in Colorado, the number of court cases in 2011 went from 39,000 to 2,036 in 2014. With the near 37,000 less court cases, the state was able to save millions on court cases and law enforcement fees. The average cost for a substance abuse treatment center in the United States is under $10,000. This is a lot cheaper than the near $31,000 on average as a nation. Some states like Connecticut, Washington, and New York pay around $50,000 to $60,000 per an inmate. Having a rehabilitation for low-level offenses cuts the cost in half and also helps prevent recidivism. 